Hi, I am Mr. Daniel, um, and right here is Ellie, Hi. Miss Ellie. Uh, we are all your teachers for the Casita classroom, the colibris, which means hummingbirds. So right here is our signing in station. We got sanitizers, and you get your parents will sign in right here. And we do, you know, our screening for the kids to make sure they are healthy, they're feeling good, and there's no. Uh, everybody's uh, there is safety here for every child. So come on in. This is our cover room, and this is our side right here. This is our beautiful uh, classroom. Here we have all the names of all the children. I come into our classroom, each, each child would sign their name here and you'll be able to take that at the end of the school year. It was thank you to uh, uh, Miss Ellie, she's very artistic so she really worked hard on this one too. And here are your cubbies. I know here's Lisa Ellie, this is my cubby. This is where you're going to have your belongings and your snacks. So come, let's go into the classroom. Welcome to Colibris. When ch when children come in, they will pick up their their name tag. So, so I'm gonna pretend I am Sasha. So they pick up their name tags and they start recognizing their names. And they will put it in their work boxes. Which is there are two sections for work boxes. One in here. And there's another war box that's right in there, so this one for Sasha. All right, so so here in this part we have the practical life lessons, and we really we want practical life in the like the first thing children see so they feel more comfortable because those are materials they have used or, or they have seen when they are at home. Uh, we have a play station, some more practical life. Here we have some orientation materials. Orientation means that those are materials that children know how to use, so they don't need a uh, presentation. Um, as we keep moving forward, this is sensorial. With that show over there is sensorial. So that's where the child explore all their senses and all the, their, uh, they train them. They learn how to use their senses. Um, right here we have our gathering area this is our right where we're gonna gather we we'll have circle time this is our calendar we'll, we'll talk we'll be using a lot of spanish in the classroom so um so the calendar everything will be talking all all about it in spanish so you have our days this is our our voice level chart they track the weather and right here this corner this is we call it the cozy corner so if the child is feeling sad, if the child is feeling is not feeling, is, is upset, we this is a place where they can uh, just calm down. You know there are some sensory material there that they can feel to make them feel safe, make them feel good. And we have some books in here, so they'll be able to sit here and and read some books. And we have this board here because um, you know the children will see their letters in their in the books and their. They're gonna look at here. They will know what the sound like, k -k cop or book, book, bat, and so forth. And then over here we have our bathroom, which is where we will be washing our hands for at least twenty seconds. So we have three sinks, and we have two bathrooms. And then over here we have all of the um, practical life materials for the bathroom. So for doing dishes and keeping our space clean and taking care of. Classroom. Yeah. And right here on top we have the the extra clothes boxes for every child. You can see the the names are already there for um, whenever there is an accident, a spill, they can change easily in the classroom. Yeah, let's go this way. Right here we have some metal inserts for tracing and right this side is math, math lessons. We'll keep uh, adding more lessons as the school year goes on, and we'll keep adding more challenging lessons. Um, right in this side is language. 
they practice, we will practice all their sounds, they start building words, they start um, reading three letter words, four letter words, depending on what their level is. And here we have some small um, uh, art shelf that will be rotating a, a lot of lessons for our show, for our, you know, children love art, it's a great, it's great for them. And in that corner, Emily, and hey, over Emily. Here, we have our art easel, um, which is for making art. We have on both sides, there's a um, little pencil case, so you can take a quiet minute and uh, make art for yourself. And here we have our tank. Um, we don't have, if you were to make a seat the last school year, uh, Coco is not here anymore. So uh, we'll have a new pet. Um, you know, send me some emails if you have any ideas of what pet we could have so be a surprise for the kids. I'll be thinking about it also this weekend. We might have it ready next week. Uh, for our lunch, we'll be having lunch in the deck uh, outside of the building. And we'll have our plenty of space so we'll make sure we'll, we'll have our distance between every child. Well, uh, I think this is all. Welcome, bienvenidos a mi casita. We're very happy that you're coming this Monday. It's been a long time since the last time I saw some of you. I'm very excited. We are very excited to see the new kids coming into our classroom and we'll work hard for you guys to make sure we, uh, we get everything you guys need to have a beautiful, awesome school year. Muchas gracias. Muchas gracias. Okay, adios.